Force is back. The Rebels won't tire till they see the last of the Empire. And Kenner's there with Star Wars Return of the Jedi Collection. It's Ewok Village. I must see my friends. Let's set. Dear me. It's C-3PO, Lagre, and Ewok Village playset. Action figures, eat sold separately. You have to put it together. Your throne, O oh Golden King, will celebrate with special stew. A barbecue. No celebration for me until my friends are free. Ewok Village playset from Star Wars Return of the Jedi Collection. Action figures sold separately from Kenner. Okay, again, another one of those commercials that's a cinematic from the movie. Uh, this time it's focusing on the Ewoks and their in the Ewok Village playset. Um, again, this is one you have to put together, which makes a lot of sense also because there's a lot of parts that are shaped in certain ways and they're small and they're pieces that definitely can't, that if it were just as you see it in a box, it would fall apart. That's why, like, just in general, things like this are that way. Uh, it's a good looking set. Um, and uh, you know it has that whole entire like le level a lever system like to pull it up like a, a little bit of an elevator kind of system for C3PO and you're going to be using C3PO most likely and some Ewoks as well as some other characters more likely than not. I mean there's some functionality there. It's obviously a smaller size playset, so uh, you know there is limits to how much you can do with it, but there's definitely something. I mean yeah, there's something there. So. It looks like a pretty decent place. It, you know, it, it serves its purpose. And, uh, you know, you have to have, a, like, one of the key points is to have some representation of all sorts of major scenes in the movie so that people can recreate them and have fun with them. And, you know, be like, oh, I love that scene in the movie. I would love to have my own place out of this. Like, that's, and that's where you get it. There's your reasoning. Now you have a reason to go and get it. Like, now I love it. Now I can do this. That's great. So, uh, my stuff. So let's keep going. Be careful! This place is crawling with biker scouts. Don't worry, they don't match for us Ewoks. From Kenner's Star Wars Return of the Jedi collection, Wicked W. Warwick and Princess Nisa each sold separately. Quiet, Nisa, here comes a biker scout. Ayala! Let's go! Yibanga! He's gaining on us! Wicked W. Warwick and Princess Nisa each sold separately from Kenner's Star Wars Return of the Jedi collection. So obviously that is one that definitely went towards the younger kids. Uh, Wicked uh, Warrior and Princess Kinesa, I think it was. Uh, interesting. Uh, if you haven't figured it out, those, yes, those are definitely supposed to be like your teddy bear-esque Ewoks. Which totally make which actually makes a ton of sense. And I was like wondering, so like, wait a second. Oh, wow, that's, like, kind of obvious. Like, why didn't I ever think about that? It's like, yeah, like, total... Like, that makes complete sense that they would do an Ewok, like, teddy bear thing. Like, duh. <laughs> I don't... Like, seriously, I just, like... I love how I didn't even think about that until now. I'm like, wait, that's kind of simple. Like, wh why didn't I even think about that right away? Like, wow. Huh. Interesting. Okay. You know, I mean, it makes a lot of sense. And, uh... It's definitely something that w would definitely be sold and uh, would do well. I guarantee it. I mean, you get like a little kid, like, psh, yeah. If, if you love the Ewoks and you want like a, a teddy bear, you, you know, you, you go to bed with, with your Ewok buddy. I mean, hey, you know what? And I'm not, I'm, I, I, I mean, hey, you know what? It, it, it's not a bad thing. If you're a little kid, that's what's happening. I mean, you're going to have your little teddy bear Ewok and it's going to be that, you know. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. It's kind of cool. So, yeah. That's about it for that commercial. Let's keep going, guys. <laughs> Get Darth Vader right where you want him. On Kenner's new Star Wars Return of the Jedi poster with the exciting Star Wars trivia game on the back. The Imperial forces are challenging you to match the names and faces of all the characters from Return of the Jedi, like Luke Skywalker and Bib Fortuna. And it's all free. Look for these details at participating stores or send two proofs of purchase from any Star Wars action figures to this address and beat the Empire at their own game. Okay, so that was a, another uh, one. This time it was about uh, the whole entire, oh yeah, if you want a poster, you can get one for free and you can get uh, on the back of it this whole entire trivia game where you can match names and all that, you know, it's not a bad idea, and the whole entire, like, proofs of pur purchase idea is definitely something that's interesting, uh, I feel like it's been done in other p cases, even today, which is kind of cool, 
Uh, one thing that that one thing that obviously is a concern in that case is that like, couldn't you just go to the store and just as easily like look at the figure and and like copy down on it? Well, back then I'm not sure about how that how well that would work. But I mean, yeah, you you probably could just copy down on a sheet of paper like the proofs of purchase purchase information and 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 just do that. I mean, obviously this was still like practically in the 80s and they most people didn't really have cameras and stuff so you couldn't take a picture i mean today yeah you would like that's what most people would just do they'd just be like snap done <laughs> like that would be it i'm not even joking either like they would just write it down and, and be and be out of, out of this room and be like um yeah that's about it for me unless they wanted to buy it i mean um but it's something to note that i actually did think about a second ago I was like hmm like, I totally get what they're doing with the whole entire proofs of purchase, because, like, proving that, oh, yeah, I bought this thing. I, I, I have, I've actually made a commitment to this franchise and all that, and here's your reward. You know, I mean, I get it, and it, it is something, and it is interesting to note that. So, uh, yeah, you know, you get a poster, you, you, and you also get a trivia game. Not too bad, not too shabby, not, not at all, you know.